Hey, it's Sean here. And in this video, we are taking a look at one of my favorite browser extensions. And the one I'm talking about and that we are looking at right on my screen here is Momentum Dashboard. So it, you can find it at momentumdash.com. And all this browser extension really does is it adds a dashboard to your browser whenever you open a new tab or when you open your browser. So you can have a look here on the right. If that's your browser, it'll add a beautiful, inspiring picture in the background. It'll add a clock so that you can see what time it is. Um, it'll either say, uh, good morning, Sean, or good afternoon, or good evening, or whatever your name is. Uh, you can also set it so that it adds a quote, an inspiring quote. So this is a very simple browser extension, but it's one of those extensions that I set up a long time ago and I still use it. And it's one of the first things I set up when I create a new profile on a browser, or if I set up a new computer, because it just makes every day just that little bit better. If you open up your browser and you're welcomed by a beautiful background image and you can immediately see what time it is. And it's just simple. It lets you focus. So, so this is their homepage. You can see here your space for calm, for positivity. What's the next one for motivation, you know, it just helps you stay focused, motivated, all these different things. So turn your potential into progress with a beautiful, simple start page, add to Chrome, it's free. 13,000 plus Chrome store reviews and three plus million active users. So if I just scroll down, transform your new tab page into a focused, productive and inspiring dashboard, do your best and most inspired work, daily inspiration, daily focus, to-do lists. So there's a feature that lets you keep track of your to-do list inside of this extension, links and bookmarks, weather and more. They do offer Momentum Plus. This is a paid upgrade, a monthly subscription. If I just open this, we can have a look what it includes. Here we can see that it is $3.33 per month to upgrade your account. You can sync with other task managers. And here you can see they've got Asana, Basecamp, Bitbucket, GitHub, Google Tasks, Microsoft To Do, Todoist, and Trello. Sadly, they don't have things on here. That's the one that I use. And I'll be honest, I don't pay for this specific piece of software, but I do use it every single day. And I'm just happy with the free option. And then you can see photos that inspire you the most. With a paid plan, you can actually change the photos and you can just select the pictures that you'd like to see. You can personalize your experience, make momentum your own by choosing a font and color that suits your personality. You can customize the quotes and you can focus on your top tasks. Uh, and then you can add more daily photos and quotes and you can obviously skip a photo or a quote as you see fit. And then you can improve your task organization, add custom to-do lists to better manage your personal productivity and focus. So, and here we go. Here's an entire list of what's all included if you choose to pay for the plus option. I personally just use the free option of this extension. I use it every day. I really enjoy it. And I will quickly show you what it looks like. So it's definitely available on Chrome. So you can add it to your Chrome browser. Here you can see in Safari, it's also available for Safari browser. And here we can see is my current browser for the day. So here's a picture in the background on the bottom left. I can see that this is somewhere in Spain. And um, there's a quote at the bottom that I really enjoy. When you notice that you're having negative thoughts about how all of this is going to pan out, you need to remind yourself that you are not a very good fortune teller. So that's really cool. And then they also add an additional quote here, action conquers fear. So these are some of the things that you can customize. So you can change this to, uh, you can customize your mantras and, and you can customize this based on your own needs. At the top here, there's also the weather. So yeah, I can see the weather currently in Cape Town, it's sunny and, and here's a bit of a forecast, which comes through from AccuWeather, which is really nice. And then you can also customize it here at the bottom. So here are the current pictures. This is the one that it's showing currently. And if you do want to now change this picture, which I never do, I just sort of accept the picture that it shows me every day. But if you do want to customize it more, you would need to upgrade to the plus option. But here under settings, if we just have a quick look, you can enable disable links, you can enable bookmarks, you can add search at the top left here, you can probably search straight from this dashboard. If you want to search uh, Google, for example, you can enable or, or you can activate or deactivate any of these options. So if I want to hide the weather, I can easily hide that. Or if I want to remove search, um, if I want to add a to-do list, I can add that. I personally don't use this dashboard for my to-do list. And then you can enable or disable various of the options. You can also add a countdown timer. That is a plus option. You can add metrics, keep your important metrics at a glance. 
notes, take quick notes and store wisdom to review, and then world clocks you can also add, which could actually be very useful, so that's something I might look into. But, so these are your basic settings, and if I have a look under to-do, so yeah, you can further customize these settings. I'm not gonna go through every option here. If you are interested, you can obviously go through all these settings. What I did recently actually notice was if you go into settings, it shows you all the quotes that it has shown you over the past. This is sort of your quote history, which I found very useful because a while back I read one of the quotes and I was like, wow, that's a very cool quote, but I can't remember it now because I didn't write it down. And then under the settings here, under quotes, you can actually have a look at your quote history, which was really awesome. And I could access any quote that was displayed over the past. I don't know if here you can look, keep going back and, and load a bunch of them, which is really awesome. Links and bookmarks, balance, so you can go through these and there's your upgrade to plus. I just wanted to give you a quick intro and an overview of this Chrome extension. It's very simple, it doesn't, it can obviously do a bunch more than it's currently doing for me, but I just like the basics, I like the clock, I like that it says good afternoon Sean, I like, I can see the weather here, I really enjoy a daily quote, and that's pretty much it, so whenever I open a new tab, it welcomes me with this dashboard and it doesn't distract me with anything. So there we go, that's MomentumDash.com. It's a browser extension available for Chrome and Safari and it is freemium, so you can start with the free option and you can upgrade it to plus if you choose to do that. If you enjoyed this video, give me a like. If you wanna see future videos, make sure to subscribe. I will be publishing videos covering various software. I'll be looking into productivity and marketing and operations management and project management. I'll be covering a bunch of apps as well as just software add-ons and especially those that I personally use and recommend. So I'll be covering a bunch of those applications moving forward to help you be more productive and more focused and more in tune with your digital environment. So if you wanna follow along, make sure to subscribe and check back for future videos. I'm Sean Toomey, wishing you an awesome day and I'll chat to you soon. Cheers.